Hello to anyone who's out there watching and for anyone who watches this later. Uh, welcome to the New Jersey Self-Advocacy Project's Brain Games. We have a game lined up every Thursday at 1 o'clock and we'll play through here on Facebook Live and uh, you can join along with us. Today we'll be playing Fibbage 3 and if you want to join in, just go to jackbox.tv right on your computer or your phone or your tablet, however you want to get on the internet. And you can enter the room code, which right now is ODCQ, and you'll join in the game. So your name will appear right by uh, mine and Ashley's, and you'll play along with us. While we wait for people to get in the room, um, I'm going to talk a little bit about, about what we have going on here at the New Jersey Self Advocacy Project. We've got a lot of stuff that you guys can get involved in. Uh, so on Thursdays, as I said, we have these brain games. On Tuesdays, we have webinars and um, some topics that are coming up are on staying connected online during this pandemic. Uh, small changes that you can make to live a healthier life. An update on COVID-19 guidelines and reopenings in New Jersey. A conversation with BSPs and the people they support. Supported decision making and ways to lower your carbon footprint. So those are all webinars coming up for the rest of August and September. Oh, I see Vaughn has joined us. Hi, Vaughn. If you're also on Facebook watching, type something in the chat, say hello, let us know how you found us. And on Wednesdays, we now have HLP Live. And that, those are really fun because they're very interactive. Um, so the next one coming up, we're actually doing a paint and sit. And that one's full, but We'll be sure to post some photos to show you how it went. And for uh, the rest of them that are coming up, we're going to have kitchen prep and safety. We're going to have another adaptive fitness training. We're going to have a massage therapist. And the last one in September is going to be a yoga class where we'll actually send out supplies. So that's when you're going to want to register early. And during the week, we also have yoga and meditation videos that are posted and we post healthy recipes. So if you're on our social media pages, those are some great things to follow along with every week. We're also doing virtual training. So if there are any topics that you're interested in, we can do trainings online through Zoom or Google Meet or whatever works for your agency. The New Jersey Statewide Self-Advocacy Network is still meeting every month. So each of our five councils will continue their monthly meetings virtually. So if you want to get involved, that's another way. And we're still working on different action alerts. We have the We Are Essential campaign that's still going. And we're trying to get self-advocates and DSPs uh, everything they need during this pandemic. So that's a lot that we have going on and we'd love to see you. So I'll probably give this until around 1.10 for people to join in. So if you're here with us, be a little bit patient and we'll get going around then.
We also have a survey going if you join us today or you've joined us before um, that you can let us know what games you've enjoyed, um, something that you'd like us to host in the future, or if you have any issues joining us, which we'd love to hear about any and all of those. So I'll put a link before this is over. If there's anyone else out there watching, you can go to jackbox.tv and type in the room code ODCQ and join us. There's still a couple minutes before we get started. And in the meantime, you can be like me and jam to this wonderful waiting music. So we're about to get started, so I'll give a brief explanation of the game. So in Vivid 3, you submit your best truth to fill in the blank about an obscure piece of trivia. And then everyone votes on which truth they think correctly completes the fact. So everyone's going to type in something and you want to try to fool everyone and then be clever enough to find the real truth in the end. And even if you don't get enough points, you can vote on which answers you found funny or amusing or clever, and you can win the uh, thumbs cup that way, which is still quite satisfying. And if you can't think of an answer before the timer runs out, there's a button that says lie for me, and it'll give you half points, but it'll put in an answer for you. So if you're running out of time, you're not sure, you can always hit that button. So let's get started. And if anyone joins uh, after this moment, you can still be in the audience. You can still type in the code and you can still uh, play along in a reduced capacity.
All right, so just type in the code again. There's BKBM. We can all get in there. Again, I'm sorry to kick us out before we started. Oh, William, you're the one joining me all day. Okay, I'm going back. Great. All right, so we can get in. Thank you, guys. All right, now all four of us get to go. All right, we're running out of time, so everyone get their answers in. Hit live for me if you can. All right, 2014 and unusual Shakespearean adaptation created in London. Set up King Lear with blank. Monte Python, sheep, dogs, or the cast of Hamilton. I think any of these could improve King Lear. All right, everyone got their answers in. Very quick. Path of Hamilton. Is it out in 24 <laughs> We both wanted it to be uh, more groups. Sheep. And sheep is the truth. Good job, William and Vaughn. Fantastic. Sheep, interesting. I wonder if they were trained thespian sheep. Well, you're all doing better than me right now. <laughs> so, doing great. Okay, and William, you get to pick the category. Okay, we're about halfway on the timer. If you want to get your answers in, you can't think of anything, you can always hit the live new button. Hurry! Okay, good job, you got it in. Hey, okay, instead of Matterhorn Mountain in Disneyland, employees installed a secret cafeteria, camera, basketball court, ice cream dispenser, or bathroom.
Ooh, I'm, I'm thankful it's not a secret camera. <laughs> full of creepy. And we all want for best, full court, the rest of us, which is true. Basketball and Matterhorn Mountain, interesting. Seen a lot of Russian sayings in this game. You have a real edge if you spoke Russian. Couple seconds left, so get your answer in. Hit Y for me, can't get one. Hit enter. Good job. Right. So the Russian saying about courting disaster translates to the woman had no trouble, so she bought a tiger, a fishing pole, a mirror, a piglet, or a bomb. Okay, timer's running out. Okay, good job. Mirror. I thought that was interesting. But not the right answer. Tiger. Ashes lie. Good one, Ashley. Bomb. And that was my lie. Piglet. I love it. I could see piglets being in trouble. <laughs> Maybe not as much as a tiger, but. Vaughn in the lead, doing great. Tiger's almost up. Put your answer in. Couple seconds. Come on. Oh. year an Oscar was won by a future president. Oh, that was their lie. We all got tricked. Child. No. William got some points for that. The U.S. government. Hmm. 
Very interesting. Well, I'm still in the lead. Halfway in the timer. Good job. Okay. So, King Will and Alexander are living a double life as a commercial pilot, nanny, offer, commoner, or spy. Commercial pilot. Interesting. You would think being a king would be enough and you'd be pretty busy, but I guess not. I like the idea of another nanny though. A lot of wild sports fans out there. I can see this going a lot of ways. Time's running out, guys. Can you get your answers in? You're going to want to hit submit now before the time runs out. Hey, the Arizona Coyotes made a plea to their fans to stop doing the wave, throwing popcorn, howling, watching football, or bringing their children. you guys oh same brain Ashley give him a wave wow I feel like that would be pretty common is that really that disruptive either why you just stop doing the wave Final round. Oh, 
Mm. You gotta type in two things for this one. About halfway now. Remember to type in two answers and then submit. And I want to get them in now. We're running out of time. Hit the live new button if you can't think of anything. I want to hit submit now. Good job. Hey, controversial Supreme Court case. Nick Sheridan upset more than a few people when the court ruled that sidewalk owners are responsible for injuries. Tomatoes are vegetables. Tomatoes are fruit. No men are good with children. Our leprechauns are fictional. These are all pretty wild. Not tomatoes or fruit. Nope. Not that sidewalk honor. Tomatoes or vegetables is the truth. So funny, right? Ashley, you knew it was about tomatoes. I just didn't know which way that court case went. <laughs> Vaughn, fantastic. And William, you got the most likes. Very clever. All right. Well, we've got some more time, so we can do another game. So let's do it. Hopefully you guys are all up for it. I have to say, Errol was really great in that last game. It was pretty close. Primer's about halfway. Getting low on time. Gonna want to hit submit. Hit the lie to me button if you can't figure it out.
Was nicht was das gerade? No Googles or Goggles. She was wearing a ferret. I wonder if it was a ferret I know. Second plan. Okay, a professional golfer with Rip Pancake raised some eyebrows and she signed an endorsement deal with Mandy, Biswick, Wait, the National Football League, or Waffle House. And it was Waffle House. I'll be honest, I focused on being a golfer. I didn't even think about her name being Pancake until I saw the answers. <laughs> Time's almost up. Sorry, I was running out of time there myself. There <laughs> wasn't up on the update foot timer. All right, the works gourmet burger debuted a PBC burger, bacon, crispin onion strings, and a patty stuffed with box, cheddar cheese, peanut, ice cream, or Reese's cup. Cheddar cheese. And it was Reese's Cups. How strange. I actually typed in peanut butter for this one and it told me I was too close to the answer. So I figured it must be Reese's Cups. Mm. 
All right, William's still in a big lead. Right, we'll spend half the time. Run down time. Couple seconds. Hey, okay, new space of Ender in Chile. Spent 10 years getting more than 80 tattoos over his entire body, which is like Julia Roberts, musical notation. Genesis, women he loves are cartoon characters. This is Genesis, Ashley Fly, cartoon characters. My life. Julia Roberts. The truth. How strange. 80 tattoos of Julia Roberts. I wonder if they were all good likeness. Oh, that was a big one for me. Really quick. <laughs> not a kiss. It's not a Mrs. Claus. Not a hug. But small Santas give fantastic life advice. I wonder what it was. Okay, long jump for London, for horses, for rabbits, for no legs, or for life.
Oh, long John's pillow again. Wasn't for rabbits. How cute, though. How cute. But it was for horses, so animals were on the right track. Final fibbers already. This is a big one. Everyone's in it because triple points. Oh, this is funny. <laughs> have catfish and have cow, have fishermen, have shrimp, have fish, have bear, have eel, have pig, have cat, have fish. I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Not catfish and cow. Good job, Ashley. Not fish and bear. Eel and pig. Half eel, half pig. Good job, William. I can't even picture that. Oh, Ah, oh, and I got the leg. Sorry, guys. Got a little too excited that year. Well, that was a lot of fun. Thank you, Vaughn. Thank you, William. Thank you, Ashley, for joining in. Everyone had some really fantastic answers. And I have to say, everyone was very quick. Usually we have a lot of trouble with the timers, but you guys are great getting your answers in, fooling people, finding the truth. So thank you so much for joining us. We'll play another game next week. Um, we might come back to play Fibbage again if you enjoyed this. And yeah, thanks for joining. I'm going to pop in the chat after I stop this, the survey, if you guys want to fill it out, if you have a moment. Um, yeah, and otherwise, oh, I see Aaron had a hello there that I didn't notice. Um, but yeah, we hope to see you next week, and feel free to join in on any of our other activities, because as I said earlier, we have so much going on, and we'd love for you to be involved. Thanks again.